God in His place. Lift up your voices in high praise, for He is the King of kings and the Lord of lords. Come on, let's bless Him, for He is the greatest. <laughs> Woo! Now clap your hands like this. So here we have Grandmama's Lemonade. I want you to come and try some of this lemonade. It's so good. Grandmama's Lemonade. Now we're going to start off with three cups of water. And then step by step, I want to show you how Grandmom did it. Three cups of water. And we're going to bring that to a boil. Now let's get started on the lemons. We're going to start cutting our lemons so we can squeeze all of the juice out. I think we're going to need two to three cups of lemon juice. So, the way that you use this, you take this in and you set it in this way. That way it catches all the seeds. There we go. Excellent. Okay, well, I'm going to get started on all these, and I will be right back. Got a lot of lemons to do. Now, here's the juice of nine lemons. Nine lemons. So, I really wanted to do three cups, but it looks like, let me see, this is one cup. Should I go ahead and do all of them, you all? Because I wanted to save some lemons. Okay, I am going to do maybe two cups. All right, so maybe next time. Because I want to save some of our lemons for another recipe that I have. So in goes... It's one cup. Let me actually see what this is. It is two cups, which is fine. Two cups. Okay, so we have two cups of fresh lemonade. Now, oh, I'm sorry, a fresh lemon juice. We're making lemonade. Now let me show you where we are with the water. Now one reason we call this old fashioned lemonade. It's because a long time ago, I remember grandma adding sugar to boiled water to get all the crystallization out. So we're going to add one cup right now, but we're going to end up adding two. Two cups, and you know it depends on how much sugar you want or how sweet you want it. And then we're gonna let all of the sugar dissolve so it becomes a simple syrup. And this makes your lemonade delicious. Let's watch how that melts. Okay, while well, that's 
becoming simple syrup, I'm going to add another cup of sugar. So right now this is going to be two cups of sugar. I really hope you all try this out. This brings back so many memories. So now this creates our simple syrup. Mmm. And we just want all of the sugar crystals to evaporate into the water. And it becomes beautiful. Look at that. That wasn't long at all, was it? Okay, now that's our simple syrup. I don't want to waste any of this. I'm going to put the rest of this in here. Perfect. Okay, I'm going to turn this off. some ice here. I want to put the ice inside of our pitcher. That's going to help cool the simple syrup down. So there are a few steps to making an old-fashioned Lemonade, but boy, oh boy, is it worth it. All right, let me get my spoon. Stir. I did cut up some lemons. Just put these in here. Taste to make sure. Okay, maybe it may need some more ice. Maybe it may need some more simple syrup. You just want everything to balance. Everything to balance out. going to taste to see if it needs anything anything else let's see look at that beautiful color look at that let's see mm -mm. mm -mm -mm -mm. oh this is good oh it's delicious let me make the glass nice and pretty for you that's good. Mm, I'll be right back. You all, I want you to try this lemonade. This lemonade is so delicious. First of all, because when you boil your water, the sugar dissolves. Guys, this lemonade was so delicious. It was so good. Let me know if you're going to try this out. This is Grandmama's lemonade. It was delicious. Come on and try it out. All right, it's your turn. These Thirsty Thursdays. Come on and join us. All right, talk to you later, guys. Peace.